The opening of this green line is a chance for the skilled workforce that worked on this line to say thank you. This particular project came at a time that uh, we were in a great recession, work was hard to come by, and the public and federal funding that this job provided to our members was extraordinary. Everything that basically you see here, uh, a labor would have had a hand in doing. It's been a great career for me. It's, a for, it's an opportunity for me to uh, create a great life for my family. The biggest initiative right now before the state legislature next year is transportation. And we hope that the success of this project showcases that we have the skilled workforce to continue to expand on our transportation resources, but also to take our aging infrastructure and to update it and to make sure that it's safe for everybody. We did outreach to train members of the community to get involved and get in to the trades, you know, and if this was the opportunity to, you know, take that path into a career. We've got a series of five ads that will be on the interior of the train. And each one of those messages draws attention to the careers available in this kind of work, but also as a way of saying that we were part of the sustainable energy project that this line is, is uh, providing commuters from Minneapolis to St. Paul. Let's not call them labor, let's call them what they really are, skilled craft construction workers.